Hello everyone, this is Pomum bringing you part 30. Part 30. I'm going to say 37 of my Fire Emblem Guide and Let's Play. Uh, turn into, into quite the Iron Man because we now have 9 units, which means we almost have the, the full roster deployed for a dungeon. And honestly, a dungeon is all we're looking for, uh, forward to at this point. Like, yeah, we have to battle Rudolph, and yeah, we have to battle Mueller, but Mueller, Mueller, Mueller. Uh, we also have Magnum in the way. Magnum is going to be our objective today. Felica is already done, as you know. Mm, I don't know what else to say. Uh, it's it's looking like like traveling here. Um, I'd honestly love to revive my units before uh, Magnum because I think Magnum is the last chapter in which you get an actual opportunity to train. Rudolf and Mueller are just so difficult. I don't, I don't think any of the ones I recover here are going to have any chance to gain levels. So I guess what that means is that I'm going to bring probably all nine of these people to the to the end. Because most of them are really, really close to promotion. Uh, we are talking here about under last level uh, before promotion. And then I'm probably, you know, tagging uh, Silk along. Oh, I, well, maybe this will be good because maybe I will have nobody up there. Yes. So if you have a lot of units, some of them, like if you have over 10, not a lot of units, some of them appear uh, up here on this side. And that's actually a big problem because you might think, oh, okay, there's not that much enemies. You you can lure the bonnets and maybe you only battle the bonnets. No, the problem is this guy. This guy invokes gargoyles continuously, and gargoyles are not a fun enemy to battle against. Um, if I had a warper, I would probably... Um, Heste, uh, true to her sister, she also invokes uh, witches. She's the sister of Heste. And here we have Magnum, a baron level 10, with 22 defense, the motherfucker. But at least he doesn't have a javelin like he does in a coast. So that means the the tactic against him is, is pretty obvious. Also, because I don't have any war, I don't have any way to make Matilda cross the river. But well, 12 speed on those gold knights and I'm guessing you have 11 with... Oh no, you have 13? Also, why is your portrait black. Are all of... No, your portrait is yellow, for example. And your portrait is yellow. It, I guess it depends on the character. You, pro, for example, have pink, but Sick just has a black pattern. Because he's that cool. Mm, you might be a problem, so I'm, I'm staying behind with... Staying behind with you, with Python. And I don't know if um No, I I'd rather you go here to lure Bone Knight. I'm going to send Matilda too. Because maybe Matilda will. I don't know. Maybe Matilda will. You know, maybe maybe she will. Maybe she will. And if she doesn't, well. She doesn't, she didn't. Now, I honestly don't know how to move, so I'm just going to wait it out for one turn and see what they do. Um, why? Why? What, what are you going to gain by doing that? Uh, also, that's a gold knight. Mm, 
Okay. I... Oh no, he probably doubles me. They have 13 days. Okay. Okay. I mean... Yeah, yes, yeah, yes, kill me. Yes, kill me. Okay, yes, kill me. At least he blocked the mage, so I might be saved by that. And I have Cliff on the back, ready to go there. But that wasn't a good idea. Okay, I, I know I doubled them back. They have 12 speed. It's me who has uh, 13 speed. Sig has the horse slayer, but even with the horse slayer he does 16, so he doesn't he doesn't one round them. Okay? Okay, I get to battle both. I think this is uh, I think we did pretty good, con all things considered. I'd like for Alm to reach like to completely substitute uh, Python, but I don't think that's possible. Which is a shame. He missed one of those. That's that's a shame too. Okay, now here come the bow knights. And they are going for Matilda because they can reach. For seven damage. Just nothing to laugh at. Uh you go for sick. Okay, so you couldn't reach Matilda. That's what I'm what I'm getting out of this. And you go for safe too. And the mage is probably going to get closer, but they kind of blocked the way of the mage. Not like he had a lot of movement, but... Okay, there goes the mage, and there goes the bow knight. Uh, okay, Grey survives. Grey survives, and that's all that counts. And he doesn't get double. I wasn't expecting him to not get double but Can Alm go there? He has five movement. One, two, three, four, five. He can go there. Which is as good. Okay, let's do it. Five damage is free because I'm going to get attacked only by the archer anyway. Alm blocks the way. I could fight, but I'm going to end it because I want to use my sword, not my bow. I know which one is better. Uh, now Python, I wanted him to snipe the mage, but I don't know how good that option is right now. He's also go in with Robin. Uh, he doesn't get doubled, and probably takes a lot of damage with 7 defense to your 18 power. Okay, yeah, he gets 11, and then he doesn't have a lot of magical defense, so maybe that's not the best. But he also can't do a lot there. Twenty-four. Well, let's try and get you out of the way with maybe my... Wasn't counting on Python doing it alone, but it doesn't help. That he doesn't... You know. Doesn't help that he doesn't help. Maybe a lucky critical here to... That's 11 damage though. So quite good. Okay, what do you have? 13 HP remaining. I can probably kill you and kill you. If I can kill the gold knights, then we are pretty much done. And they have... Okay, let me check this. They have 13 defense, so I need 21 damage. I have 17 here. Until they're getting hit by three bonnets, I, I don't really care about. She should dodge something, right? Okay, 
I'm going to do it like this. You go for this guy, maybe you get, get a critical and then I don't have to worry about it. You didn't. And uh, you don't dodge. Okay, so that, that's actually like... Very bad. Very, very, very bad. But we will be okay because I, I trust you. I trust you. And also, also they can reach Ryuto easily. So yeah, that, that, that that's that's nice. That's okay. That's okay. No problem. No problem. And they can kill Ryuto. Yeah. No. No problem. No problem. Warp. I'm really missing warp here. Maybe I will kill this. No. They are tanky too. Oh, nets. I'm banking on misses here because I'm, I'm not going to survive uh, if they don't miss something. And then I will put it up here. I think here should be safe. I can physic Matilda, which is honestly a good option. Considering the situation. I'd rather Ryuto die than Matilda, and let's see how it goes. It's not a good start, and I, I did say that this was the training map remaining. With her cast fortified, yeah, oh, yeah, of course, we, we needed that, we needed that. Why are they going up there? Why is that bow knight going there? I don't understand. Well, that's good. I need the other Vault Knight to go down and then I'm safe from my Ekar attacks, which are his only weakness. Except he's going to kill. Okay. Not even mad. Like you can also kill both Vault Knights and then take care of the mage yourself, and, and I will be very okay with that too. Five damage. Maybe the bonnet will actually go for um, for Gray. He gets the option. Yeah, now the mage is going for um. Okay, attacks Robin. Robin dodges. So they are going for Robin over Luthier. Maybe I gave Luthier a shield and I don't even remember. Uh, but Robin has good dodge, so it's, it's it's doing okay. Very nice, very nice. And you go for sick, and I don't care. Well, maybe I do care. Maybe I do care. Please don't hit me. Okay. Okay. And uh, yeah, that's the. The last menace. Death. Death is scary, but I should be able to take it. And I don't have to. Okay, I dodge both. Getting really lucky with the dodges here. It's what I deserve, but. Okay, so the mage. The mage is a problem, so my. Core instinct is to not move Gray because Gray is going to. He's not going to be useful on the other side anyway. So maybe by using Gray here and then finishing with Arm, because Arm can use those. There we go. Arm actually has base uh, 3 range because this is. I could have probably swapped them with Arm and then killed with Grey, but I didn't want to check the stats. Okay, you have 34, you have 40, and you have 40. I'm going to start killing from here. You normally move... This is the golf rule of movement in Fire Emblem. You move your units that are behind first so that you can 
reach the most enemies. It's the rule of something. It's probably the rule of something. Okay, we have Excalibur here. Uh, critical would be nice. Would be appreciated greatly, but we don't get those. We don't get those. Uh, still, with the combined effort of all of our units, we are able to take down one bone. Very good. There goes one bone. 22 experience for Python, who's really, really closing in to that level up. I have 34. And I have a Holy Lance that might get a critical on you. And if it doesn't, then I go for Sig, taking the kill. Critical? Or even a critical would I kill. Okay. Okay. Yes. That's the kind of damage I want to see. And another 13. There we go. I can't wait to promote Matilda. Like, getting. Heavy damage on Matilda is is just nice. Hmm. Going to use Excalibur on you because I think yes, weakening you is a good idea. Oh, if I get a critical, if I got a critical there, I would have killed you. Okay, who's weakened? Are full health, uh, you survive no problem. You might have some trouble. Sick actually could face some trouble against the mage, and considering how good he has proven. Oh no, no, no! Why should I have to decide? Fortify. Fortify was cast. It costs quite a lot. But I recover everyone, and that's all my units move. Okay. Witches being invoked. Uh, gargoyles starting to appear. The enemies are doing their. I don't know, their strange dance. Doesn't make a lot of sense to me, but. Okay. I'm actually curious if I'm going to recover health, because I'm not using the sword, but I have it equipped, of course, it's, it's an item on my inventory. I think I am, because I, I know you can give the regal sword to a healer in, in Echoes and they still recover health. Uh, you went for sick with death. Sick is going to survive that, right? survives with all health because you know and do I counter? Oh yes I do or seven times two very effective I have 10 HP and I honestly think uh, this is a good idea might be wrong. I was kind of wrong. Kind of wrong, but not really. Because even if I can't take it, you can take it. So if Python gets a kill, he should get the kill. Yes, exactly. 24 experience, almost a level up for Python. Almost. But those Almost level ups can be turned into level ups once we enter the secret shrine. So, okay, yeah, come, come at me. Three damage. Okay, pathetic. Go. You're dismissed. Twenty-seven experience. There we go. Sixty-two, eleven, fourteen. 
11.59. Now this 11.14 looks like he wants to, you know, take a life. Why don't you take the, the mage out? Now that I know you do some good damage to them. And you... 361 and... You know, I really want Matilda <laughs> to get a kill here. Especially because I'm going to start moving to the to the other side, so... Oh! He has full health. Okay, then Matilda is not going to get it. What's the remaining HP? Because I think I do 13. Fuck. Okay, maybe we'll miss one of those. If I don't miss, then Sig takes the kill. If I do miss, then I can give it to Robin or something. Yeah, that's, that, that sounds like a good idea. Up like 90% hit, but... Okay, it could happen. Wouldn't be the first time. With an experience there... I don't think Sig got even one level up since he joined me. Or whatever. Uh, less assault. He has to, you know, make things faster. Let's go. Uh, what? Oh, because I can't war. This is actually going to be very bad. And I mean very bad. Very bad. Oh. Okay, okay. You're going for arm. You shouldn't double. That's nine damage. Do you warp two? Yes. Do you go for arm two? No. Doesn't look like it. You go for Robin. Okay, you don't double either. Okay. I mean, that's something we can start doing. Gargoyles are moving down. I don't know how I'm going to take care of the enemies. Especially because this is Gaiden, like, there's no other way of winning the chapter. You have to take care of the enemies. Okay, you can try and take this one, Robin. A critical would have killed there. Well, he still dodges like a champ, so even if he's not a dread fighter yet, he's kind of reliable against mages, which is funny. Python. Attack. We like to weaken before we take kills. You double? Oh yeah, you double. I forgot how... How much magic slows down units in this game. With experience there. Power up and Python can be promoted. Now power power might be the only thing that's over the the promotion bonuses. Now you just have to make sure that Python survives. How do you make sure of that? Uh, I don't know. You tell me. I, I don't know why I always doubt about using physic when physic is quite literally the only thing or well, the most basic thing that it has to heal. Like she doesn't have to recover. She gets physics. And I'm starting to doubt because some units didn't move. I'm thinking maybe they can't cross the rivers. Like they can't cross them at all. And that could be a big problem. Okay, yeah, that's all of them. I think. Did they move sick? Or is sick behind? I think he might be. Um, I don't like that. I don't like that. No, they're sick. Uh, you go for Tita. Uh, interesting choice, considering you don't do any 
damage, and you don't even double it. So like, in a in an average battle, Tita just ends up with the same HP she started with. But you, you do you. I'm not going to complain. Uh, yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, these are my units. For a moment there, I had the the hope that maybe I was missing someone, but I'm not. These are all my units. I don't have any anyone else. Power and defense and HP. Oh, oh, that was arm. I thought that was my archer. Power and defense and HP. That's 14 defense, 25 power. I know the, the weapon is counted in, but... And now Grey, who's probably going to be the target. That's bad. Can I reach? Maybe I can reach with Cleave. No. No, yes, barely. Okay, Python just has to survive, so I'm going to place him there. Not kill. Matilda, they actually gave a lot of experience, so if Ryuto could do it... If Ryuto can do it, then he can probably get a... She don't. And also, she takes 3 damage, because I forgot which is half of the resistance. Mm, give it to Robin. Give the witches to the mercenary. Come on! Oh, she's in a forest! She's in a forest. Ah, she's in a forest. Now that explains some things. Well then, another Excalibur, because I don't want to deal with the rain. Yeah, two damage. An experience for Cliff, only 10 experience. But we are getting closer, getting closer. That 69 is a good number. I'm not saying that... No. You know what? We deserve a 45. I doubt it there, but we deserve one. We are still out of range of you. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Even if you have 8 movement, I would be safe. Do you want to go for 6? Be my guest. And Matilda... I don't know, she, she is there. She's getting closer. She could actually get some nice experience out of the gargoyles. What I don't know how I'm going to do is, is just crossing the river. You know, I normally do this with war, but I don't have war. So am I supposed to grind Tita until she has war? Or just... I don't know. I see a lot of problems with my... You went for Robin. Okay, so I'm glad I fortified. Because maybe many of them are going to go against Robin. Okay, there's seven witches on waiting. <laughs> also, I'm wielding the bow still. He probably does like 10 or so, 11, but yeah, he's still very good with the bow, but he doesn't one run them, you know? It's not the same, it's not the same. Mm -hmm. Okay, <laughs> even a critical, just ending them completely. I guess Alm is going to... Well, not Alm, but... This is a start. Look at this. Very good. Now who said ever that archers are archers are bad? Archers are the fucking best. Look at this. Archers. Who did that? An archer. And who's going to finish that? An archer lord. Gaiden did it first, guys. Lin is not an original unit. Lin is actually a copy of Arm. Probably, kinda. I of course 
I'm joking. You, you, you know that, right? I actually really like it. Lynn got, got a horse on promotion. I think she would be very interesting if she had a horse. She would be like a nomad lord, you know? I, I know that the whole idea about the bow is already to uh, uh, get into her her inner nomad and embrace the sake and inheritance and that's why she uses a bow because bows are really the sake weapon. It's even the you know Han on the one of the of the elites that uh, was from sake used a bow. That part I get, but then she doesn't ever give bows the same attention as she gives to swords, like obviously. She gets a legendary sword and she's called a fucking blade lord and she's not a sword master. I think she would even benefit more from a... well not even, she would obviously benefit more from a, a buff to critical. Much more than she benefits from, you know, just having bows. Yeah, Swordmaster Lim would probably be better than Blade Lord Lim. There we go. What? What are you doing? Fortify. Why are you moving there? I don't understand. And you go around. So you're going to get countered. Why do you want to get countered by Arn? Yeah, maybe that's why. Maybe that's why. Uh, which? Can't reach anyone. Teleported there to die. Uh, which? Goes for Arn. So she dies. She does 9 damage, which is terrifying, but dies soon. And also has a lot of HP, by the way, which is one thing I really appreciate. I talk ab about his stats a lot, like how I'm surprised he's that fast, when I think he's supposed to have some speed travel sometimes. And he's also really tanky, really strong, but something I should really appreciate from him is, yes, he's sheer amount of HP, like even if he takes enemies, see that, that was 9 damage and he still has half his health to spare. He could probably take on 4 witches and still survive, and that's not any merit to his resistance, it's just, you know, he, he has so much, okay, I, mean, I could run into some trouble here with all these units around them, the bow right there, waiting for me to to calm down, not to calm down, to, to lower my guard, that's what I mean. I really, I really want to kill the gargoyle with Vita, but first of all I can't reach, and second of all, I want. Okay. Okay, I think I think I will do this. I know I take damage, but I don't care. Kind of? Okay. Very good. Then I will follow up with arm. Considering my options here. Okay. Yeah, this is good. This is good because she might be targeted by a mage, but she doesn't really care. She has like... Was it 11 resistance? Fight with a bow? I don't know why I'm close in... in might not have been the best idea. Now that I'm considering my options like really really coldly, thinking 
thinking. This was probably a bad idea. Because now Alm is in the range of a lot of enemies and his HP is low. Uh, I have Tita, so I can heal, but... Who can reach there? Basically, you two. You go there. Take out the witch. Not my favorite option, but it's what we do. Get experience, okay. You don't really need it. I just gave it to you because... But no one better to get it. Fortify. I like how the how the holy holy shield on Tita does a double function. It recovers her health, but it also uh, keeps her health replenished as a ring would do. So it's kind of a safeguard from monsters ring. Pretty funny combination of item and character, I find. I definitely never tried it before. I normally choose the silver shield. Okay. That's one mage that's not going to attack on. So that's good. And doesn't do anything. I almost want them to attack someone so I can calculate the you know the damage they do. You know the raw damage they do from the resistance of the unit they attack. This guy attacked from close range, but not for, from two range. Okay, so is the mage going to... the mage is not going to do anything. Why? Why do you not want to do anything? I'm not complaining. Okay, first, I will weaken you. Maybe I will just weaken you, like I'm measuring, yeah, okay. Sorry, that was Python perfectly calculating the amount of damage I need to do, so that he doesn't take uh, a kill from his body. Go. Fourteen experience, very good. I think I still want to do this. Yeah. Looks like a good idea to me. Yes. Very good. Oh, neck down. I think there's another one. Yeah, this one. Now, can I cross the river? No. So, Matilda is not going to be helpful there. Cliff. Um. No cliff. You can start doing some things there. Let's do some Excalibur. I can probably close the river on foot with some characters. Very nice. No death. Okay, no mages except the shaman and the witches. The witches are a big factor in here. Not gonna lie. There are the gargoyles to look forward to, but that's about it. And then there. I have Ryuto with a ring. And that means Excalibur. I can do that on the boss too, which is funny as hell. And Robin gets those. Okay, your move. Because I hope this doesn't become a stalemate. Someone has to be able to cross the river, right? I know mercenaries can, actually. I doubt there are different types of water in this game, so... Mercenaries have to be able to cross rivers, because they did so in... in Celica's side. Okay, that's a lot of gargoyles. I didn't notice you invoke that many this time. What are we talking about here? 
84 to your 32. You absolutely, no, 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 no. Excalibur, you absolutely deserve to take this skill, so just take it, just. I don't even think you need a critical, okay. No critical needed, 20 experience, we are 52 now. No range inside. Can Cliff close the river? No, he can't. Can the archers close the river? No, they can't. But they can target enemies, so... That's good. Oh! Much more than I was expecting there. Okay, I, I guess I will just make a line and try to kill things in that line. Can Alm close the river, by the way? Oh, he can. Oh, I see. Okay, then I kind of have to cross the river with Alm. Okay, it's 11 to them. Maybe some of the witches have working AI and they are going to go for him more so. 22 power and he has what? 14 defense? Yeah, so he only takes 8 damage from the barons to his incredible 41 HP. Yeah. I think that's what you are supposed to do. By the way... What's to your HP? Might heal Ryuto, just in case I know he can have some trouble dealing with fast enemies. And if they try to target Tita, they are going to, you know, run into trouble. Because they are going to find themselves bashing against the Holy Shield, so I'm, I'm not afraid about that. Okay, went for Cliff, I think. Yeah. Oh, I equip fire on any enemy face, then no trouble at all, because I'm not going to be able to kill. Okay, as expected, they went for Tita because they don't recognize the shield. They can't sense the shield. Oh, Tita does 7 damage? Twice? How? How does she double? Did they like really fell speed wise? I remember Garwells being fast. That's Ryoto. Okay, Ryoto gets doubled by them. At least, like, someone had to get doubled. But Tita doubled in them. And doesn't she have like only 10 base and, and then shouldn't Nosferatu weight her down like another 3? Do they have less than 7 speed? Or maybe Nosferatu is very light in this game. Maybe they made it heavier in Echo so that it would more or less balance. Okay, very good, very good, very good. I like it, I like it. Uh, witches. That's working AI, yeah. So those are witches that decided they don't like to teleport. And I don't know if that's good, because now they have piled up around the boss. And killing the boss is, after all, my main objective. Oh! Okay, you changed your mind about warping. Eleven. Uh, but eleven only once, and I doubled you for fourteen, so that wasn't a good idea at all. Ganging up on people is not nice. Okay, you went for Robin, so you are spreading around. Might be able to do something against you yet. By the way, uh, he is healing, even while using bows. If I go in here, 
by using the sword, I should still be able to fight against, uh, you know, the, the, the bar. Nice. Now you should be able to cross raiders. Pekon has level 10, you have level 9, so you are the one... The one that I want. The one that I want. Ooh, 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 perfect. That's 5 experience. Okay, I need to hit, use everyone here. I, I need to use everyone, everyone. I was going to try and target the kills, place them more or less. Yeah, no, I have to use everyone. Uh, there's like another four targets to kill after this one. Okay, with power and defense. Let's go! Okay, Zeke. Zeke is proving to be incredible. So Zeke is definitely coming to the last map. Um, Robin, I would like for Robin to come. Not to the last map, uh, well, to the last map too, but I mean to up there for my armies. Up 19. Uh, I'm going to angel you. And yell. Boom. 31. Yeah, they don't... I just remember that uh, drones are supposed to have some resistance. I can't I can't cross that and I don't like how I can't cross it. Is it actually a, a, a river that I can only cross with arm and I have to, you know, do everything with arm there? I have 1185 and yeah, so that looks like a kill for Matilda, unless I'm able to, I mean unless I miss, but with that accuracy it doesn't seem to be likely, okay, okay, only 9 experience, this is low experience games. Oh, normal mode. Normal mode. How I miss you, normal mode. Even though I don't know you, normal mode. Okay. Someone is calling to my phone, so I'm just going to leave you with this. Actually, really good enemy face, it seems like. And I'm back. Okay, nothing really happened here. Seems like there aren't a lot of enemies. Now, can Robin... Yeah, Robin can cross. Robin can cross. He just has to be on the border. And Tita doesn't look like she can cross. 
Okay then. What's your HP? Only 12? And I think I can try to do some... Cheeky shit. Yes. Excalibur. Excalibur. Get experience there. Sword. I probably one shot you. Not even joking. Almost. Almost. One point of strength missing from one shotting witches. I won't run them with a bow, which is probably the benchmark you want to hit anyway. Uh, being able to enemy face them with arm is probably the, the best thing you can do against them if you are forced to battle them with arm, which I hope I'm not. Okay, here comes the boss. You don't even say anything to me. You're just Magnum the bar. Do 12 damage. Because you have a 26 attack, then I do a critical. I almost don't do damage. Only do 3 damage to you. That's not ideal. Also, why are you moving? Whatever. Whatever. I don't mind. Because I have nothing. Okay. Go here and uh, visit you. Very nice. You can cross the river back. Actually, you know what? I want you to be behind the earth, through the river. And then I want to see here, and I don't know, some people that can take that. Yeah. Looking good to me. Now you go for arm, as expected. Alm shouldn't kill you, but then I can target you easily with mages and shit. Bows, you know the deal. Okay, another critical. Another critical, let's go. And a finisher, so he's probably going to get healing AI. Okay, um, you want more detail? Didn't think about that, but he doesn't double, so it's okay. It was actually the right move. Okay, let's use the sword on you. Another critical, let's fucking go. Now he's probably in healing AI. But he can't escape, he's a bucket bar. He, he doesn't have movement. They, they are just bad glasses. And another 3 damage. Okay, HP remaining, 16. Ryuto, what do you say to 16 damage? That means you just have to get a critical here. Okay, you don't double, which is not ideal. Cliff, do you kill? Yeah, you do something with your lightning and your shit. Okay, you kill, you kill. As expected, even I fell. This is experience and Cliff reaches level 12 with magic and defense. Can be promoted to Sage, and honestly, his defense, which is 12, without a shield, is looking like Cliff is going to be one of my tankier units. Because he's well over the, the base of a Sage, I would assume. If, if Sages have more than 12 defense naturally, then I have to change my opinion on the class. Okay, level 10 there. Can be promoted to Slayer. They are piling up. 
crear file en nada. Sniper goes for you. A safe damage. You are probably under half health, so you're, you're probably going to run away. I'm not even going to bother targeting you with Python. The thing I am going to do is run away with Tito because I don't want to risk you killing me. And who really needs the healing? Round 35, you survive anything that's on your range, I think. You also do, you also do, you kind of also do. You also do. Okay, I, I think I'm healing real. I honestly think the bow knight might go for Ryuto because he might be able to double Ryuto. Uh, was it Ryuto who was hurt? I could swear he was like. Well, whatever. And that's it. Now there are three enemies remaining on the map. Okay, four. Yeah, he's running away, he's running away. Like a bitch. But I don't care. I'm going to pursue him. First of all, we heal Alm. Now we kill you. We really kill you. Like we, we kill you hard. I've got 18. Okay. Now. 1, 2, 3, 4. You have 4 movement, right? Yeah, okay. So you don't move yet. I'm going to get close. Because Arm is probably going to get attacked there. And these are going to be extra important turns. Because I have to do everything with the. with uh, Arm and Robin's command of, of assault. Okay. Now let's battle you with a bow. Not the ideal situation, but it's going to be enough. I will position myself here. Do I even heal? I'm going to save my HP for a potential fortify in case I need to heal both. You go for them, as expected. Maybe I shouldn't have done that because now you're using Aura from a... Okay. I hit you anyway. Now the witch, the other witch gets away, maybe? Yes, yes, yes. Calculated. Calcu fucking later. Yes, I did calculate this. I wanted her to get in range, the other one to get away, and then I can do this. And the other witch dies anyway when I slay her, so. Oh, you don't. You aren't like an invoke. Interesting. Okay, then I guess. No, I actually want the tile. Well, no, I don't need to heal. Maybe I will because you will target me. I w I'm just going to attack you from here. I like the fact of attacking from a tile of healing. Okay. Doesn't roll, it doesn't roll. Stop you off. Guess I was too concerned. They are doing just fine. Uh, okay, it was good that I put the bow because there you go. Which is a slain, and now we just have to take care of the country. Who should die easily, and I don't really care who I give the experience to because, well, I guess Alm 
is a better option. Because the game might have like uh, internal level or something, I uh, Is that a critical? I, I saw like a pause in the animation for a while. And you only have a slime, not death, so that should do not death to me. Oh, that's 20 damage. But that's a critical. So the map... The map is... Over! Magnum has been conquered. And why the fuck did a dragon just assemble? Are they going to accost me? Like, I, I, are they going to prosecute me? Or do they just appear to remind me that I can't go back? Whatever. Units? Robin. Made it in time to promotion. Ryuto. Has uh, 18 experience remaining for promotion. Python made it. Matilda has 28. Honestly surprised that she's the one that has the most left. Grey. Also surprised because he killed a lot of dragons last chapter and a lot of units this chapter. And Cliff made it. So... I mean, all of them are going to enter the shrine, which is their hidden shrine. As you can see, you just have to check. There's the hidden shrine. But that's going to be next part, because well, I, I think I I deserve some rest after this chapter. Uh, for now, this has been Pomum. Like, subscribe, leave a comment, and I will see you in the next part. Bye.